so I tried something else. And then for my second book club pick, um, I decided I would ask readers to take up the challenge and the infinite joy of reading Song of Solomon. Song of Solomon. You know, it, it's the only book that, and no matter how many times I've read it, I can still find surprises on every page, a turn of phrase or a sentence that's so fluid that you just want to spoon feed every word to yourself. So when I read that first, that was the first Toni uh, Morrison novel I read was uh, Song of Solomon. And a love affair was born right then. All told, more books chosen by for Toni Morrison than any other books on the Oprah Book Club on TV, uh, four in all. And I was so excited because it was an opportunity to have millions of people who otherwise might not have ventured into Morrison territory uh, come to worship at her altar, as I do. So Tony observed this in her Nobel acceptance speech in 1993. She said, word work is sublime because it is generative, it makes meaning that secures our dip 